For years, updating the iPhone through Windows has been a pretty reliable way, especially when the OTA Akka over the air update tends to get stuck or doesn't work as expected. I have relied on this native method to update the software on my iPhone. Sadly, for many users, updating the iPhone via iTunes is not working due to certain regions. If this problem has come in the way of your software update as well, I have got you covered with some handy fixes. That's it. Let's get us that. First off, I would suggest you to force quit the iTunes app on your computer. For a handful of users, force killing the iTunes app has done the trick. Therefore, I would suggest you to give it a try. First off, to do so, you have to disconnect your iPhone from your computer. And then you have to press the Ctrl plus Shift plus Escape keys to reveal the task manager. And then you have to hit the iTunes icon in the left sidebar. And then you have to hit the End Task option in the top row of options. And then you have to connect your iPhone to your computer and launch the iTunes app. And then you have to click on check for the update option and then go through the process as usual. Then I would recommend you to ensure that you are using a compatible USB cable. Are you trying to use an uncertified cable or a damaged one? If the answer is yes, there is a decent chance that the cable is preventing the software update. If you still can't update your iOS device through iTunes, it wouldn't be completely wrong to put the entire blame on a software glitch. Therefore, I would suggest you to update the iTunes app on your computer. To do so, you have to launch the Microsoft Store app on your computer. And then you have to select the Library tab in the left sidebar. And then you have to scroll down to find the iTunes app and then update it, just like any other app. Just like any other software, iTunes also has an off day and does run into some issues once in a while. So launch a browser and then go to Apple system status page and check whether or not iTunes is running as expected. Should the problem persist, I would suggest you to reinstall the iTunes app. A fresh installation of the app might result in getting rid of the problem. To do so, you have to click on the start menu and then you have to select the settings app. And then you have to go to the apps section and choose the installed apps option. And then you have to click on the triple dot icon right next to iTunes and then hit uninstall option in the menu. And then you have to open the Microsoft Store app and then you have to search for iTunes and then install it. If nothing has worked in fixing this problem, I would suggest you to update your Windows device because I suspect that a software bug might be causing the problem. To do so, you have to launch the settings app on your computer and then select the Windows Update option in the sidebar. And finally, you have to download and install the latest Windows Update and that's pretty much it. So, these are the best tips and tricks through which you'll be able to fix iPhone is not updating through iTunes problem. Hopefully, you have gotten the better at the problem. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a good time. Bye-bye.